Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I am Sia. So today, what are we going to do is we are going to continue with our chapter resources and development, and this video is going to be the last part of this chapter. So let's start with arid soil. This soil ranges from red to brown in color. So the color range of arid soil is red to brown. This soil is sandy in texture and saline in nature. When we when we move downwards, that is, जब हम downwards जाते हैं, जब हम नीचे की तरफ जाते हैं soil में, so the calcium content increases. Fine. So it means that the calcium content at अपर लेयर ऑफ दिस सॉइल इज लो एंड एज वी मूव डाउनवर्ड्स कैल्शियम कंटेंट इंक्रीजेस सॉइल लैक्स ह्यूमस एंड मॉइस्चर आफ्टर प्रॉपर इरीगेशन दिस सॉइल कैन बी यूज फॉर कल्टिवेशन सो गाइज लेट मी रिपीट दिस थिंग विच आई एम रिपीटिंग फ्रो सिंस द लास्ट टू वीडियोज दैट आई हैव नॉट रिटर्न ऑल द पॉइंट्स सो प्लीज डोंट कम टू मी एंड कॉमेंट डाउन बिलो दैट सी आई यू हैव नॉट रिटर्न दिस पॉइंट और यू हैव नॉट रिटर्न दिस पॉइंट सी आई हैव रिटर्न ओनली दोज पॉइंट्स विच आर इम्पॉर्टेंट एंड दोज पॉइंट्स विच कैन कम एंड यू विच कैन कम इन योर पेपर एंड यू हैव टू राइट इन योर पेपर फाइन so moving ahead to forest soil these soils are found in the hilly and mountainous areas as the name suggests that forest soil are found so as the name suggests why i said that as the name suggests as we all know that forests are forests are mostly or mainly found in hilly or mountainous areas that's why the name suggests that these soils are mostly found or uh, these soils are found in the hilly and mountainous areas they are loamy and silty in valley sides and are coarse grained in the upper slopes in the snow covered areas of himalayas these soils experience denudation now what is denudation denudation is weathering and are acidic with low humus content so the humus content of these soils is low moving ahead to the last topic of this chapter that is soil erosion and soil conservation now it's very very you know it's very very boring to tell you the definition of soil erosion as you are studying this definition of soil erosion since i guess 6th or 7th so bas just for revision i have i have written the definition of soil erosion so what is soil erosion removal of top fertile layer of soil by natural gradients or agents like wind water glacier is known as soil erosion fine i hope you all have understood so so there are some important term which you need to memorize from this topic and that are the running water cuts through the clay soil and makes deep channels as gullies now a question can be asked in your paper that what do you mean by gullies or what are gullies or how gullies are formed so these are the three types types of questions which can be formed in your paper on gullies fine so what are you going to write this we are uh, you are going to write only this line in your paper for all three questions the answer is same for this gullies word or a uh, question containing gullies as uh, why am now a question will be arising in your mind that why are we going to write only this line as so let me answer this question we are going to write this line only because not much information is given in your big book about gullies so as you all can imagine let me elaborate it uh, so as you all can imagine that uh, so please imagine clay soils in your mind and please imagine running water so if you will observe clay soil if you will imagine and observe in your imagination that there is a clay soil and water is running continuously from it so if a water will run through a clay soil then obviously it will cut as clay soils have a high a uh, water holding capacity due to which it makes it moisturize fine so the uh, let us move on the next point the land which becomes unfit for cultivation is known as barren land as we all know uh, the land on which we can't cultivate crops is known as bad bad land in chambal basin bad lands are called ravines washing of top layer of soil is called sheet erosion so these are some important terms which you have to memorize for your paper and these can be asked for one marks fine not more than that so moving on to last thing that is soil conservation measures 
fine so i told you that there is soil erosion as we all know that soil erosion exists in this environment but there are some measures to imp uh, to you know stop soil erosion or to prevent uh, or to prevent soil erosion so it's very important to prevent soil as a removal of top fertile layer of soil is called soil erosion fine so top fertile layer top it is the top fertile layer only due to which a soil is cultivable or is not unfit for cultivation fine so we have to preserve our soil so these are the following measures through which we can preserve our soil so let's get started so the first point is contour plowing plowing along contour lines decelerate the flow of water down through the slope then is terrace cultivation then the third is strip cropping large fields can be divided into strips now please imagine a large field into your mind and then imagine that they are divided that the large field is divided into strips fine sabse pehle kya hai ek crop ki line hai fine imagine ek sarso ka khet hai fine uh, so ab ek line hai hamari mustard seed ki fine fir humne ek line chhod di ठीक है ना जो हमने उस जो अभी हमने एक लाइन छोड़ी है अब इसमें हम क्या करेंगे वी आर गन प्लांट रोज ऑफ ग्रास इन दिस एम टी रो देन आफ्टर दिस रो ऑफ ग्रास देन अगेन वी आर गोइंग टू प्लांट अ रो ऑफ मस्टर्ड सीड्स देन दिस विल कंटिन्यू सो दिस टाइप ऑफ स्ट्रिप्स कैन बी लेफ्ट बिटवीन द यू नो स्ट्रिप्स ऑफ मेन क्रॉप्स विच कैन यू नो what is the motive of gro uh, growing grass in between the crops to break the flow of wind hence to prevent our crops and soil erosion then there are shelter belts planting lines trees instead of grass ones fine planting lines of trees ab humne yahan pe kya kiya tha in strip cropping we planted rows of grass but instead of rows of grass we can also plant rows of you know trees so they will work in a similar way uh, what do you mean by similar way that is they'll break the flow of wind then the last is stabilization of sand dunes so guys that's all for this chapter and if you haven't understood anything from this chapter then please comment down below i'll try to resolve each and every query of yours and guys guys please don't forget to subscribe my channel it's free yaar main hamesha bol chuki karta hi nahi hai please kar do i am waiting please karo yaar then please yaar if you found this video helpful then please give it a big fat thumbs up and i know you found it helpful and yes please don't forget to share it also please so until my next video please stay tuned bye